All right, I came across this really insane article. So apparently, a bunch of these pro-abortion anarchist social lefties are gonna are planning to storm churches on Mother's Day between May eighth and May fourteenth to basically make a point and just vetch over abortion being possibly you know allowed to be criminalized in America. This is the kind of behavior that these social lefties and liberals get themselves into. So I'm gonna read this article. This is on. Uh, robertspencer.org, formerly called Jihad Watch, and they have branched out to where they do also still cover Islam, but also other stuff too. And it says here, pro-abortion group encourages supporters to storm churches nationwide on Mother's Day. The left war against civility and the peacefulness of the nation in general looks as if it's about to escalate. Yeah, exactly, and this is the kind of behavior these pro-abortion, this, see this right here is the true colors of the pro-abortion lobby. Okay, now on to the, continuing on in the article. Uh, abortion groups imply they're planning to storm Catholic churches on Sunday after Roe v. Wade, after over Roe v. Wade, sorry, not good at reading on computer, by Christine Stellar's Daily Caller, May 6, 2022. The pro-choice group Ruth sent us implied they're planning to storm Catholic and evangelical churches on Sunday in protest of the potential overturning of Roe v. Wade, according to a social media post Tuesday. The group whose name honors the late Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg, who is dead now and in hell, just want to point that out, shared a video on their Twitter feed showing women wearing red cloaks protesting about women abortion rights inside a Catholic church. The group call also called for a, quote, Mother's Day strike on Sunday alongside fellow pro-choice group Strike for Choice. Quote, this is what Mother's Day should look like, unquote. The group wrote in their tweet encouraging supporters to protest at Catholic and evangelical churches, quote unquote, nationwide. Um, but if I, I uh, irony to that statement, Mother's Day, um, abortion is the exact opposite of being a mother. Okay, if you're a mother, abortion kind of cancels that. So, oh, this is what Mother's Day should look like. Um, you want, you think abortion has anything to do with Mother's Day? No, abortion prevents you from being a mother. It's a bunch of, uh, just a bunch, I mean, a bunch of, of just lunacy from these pro-abortion anarchists. But what do you expect? It's that simple. This, this is the kind of fruit, this, this right here is the true colors of the pro-abortion lobby, a bunch of lawless anarchists. So don't be deceived. Uh, like, uh, 1 Samuel chapter 15, verse 23, it says, rebellion is as a sin of witchcraft. This right here is proof of that. So don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Oh, also, I want to just a little side note as well. Uh, just before I end this video, Roman Catholicism is not Christianity. Roman Catholicism is a satanic uh, Babylonian religion condemned in Revelation chapter 17 and chapter 18 and identified as Mystery Babylon. So I wanted to point that out. Uh, Roman Catholicism is not Christianity. However, you know, a broken clock is right twice a day. And the Catholic Church opposition to abortion is something they got right. So... Just wanted to point that out. So anyway, don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Sorry. Goodbye.